my name is AJ Pura and I am the author of the Anathalian series. I'm also a self-published author and I do my own interior formatting. And interior formatting is what this video and this series of videos will be about. Um, so I'm going to walk you through all the steps of interior formatting from, I use one of my own books and I took videos from the steps of just having the text and not even having the text in the right font that I wanted all the way up until publishing. So every single step, each video will be a different step. So I'll go in depth into each step, um, as much in depth as you can. Some will be very short, like changing the font type, um, and some will be a lot more in depth, like putting pictures into your manuscript. So if you have any questions about interior formatting, watch this video, watch this series of videos. Also, I have a longer video that talks about many aspects of formatting and it puts it all in one video. So I will link that video below. Um, this video will be in a playlist once I get more than one video. This video and series will be in a playlist, but I will also link that long video below. So if you, um, so if this is one of the earlier videos and you don't find what you want yet, you can find what you want in that longer video. And you can always ask questions in the comments, of course. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to format your table of contents. There are different ways to do this, but this is how I do it. Table of contents is going to be this page over here. You want to look back at your headers and how you did those. Um, I have a separate video showing how to do those. And so we're not going to talk about that in depth, but um, I highlighted table of contents. That's going to be the title of this page. And then you're going to uppercase all those letters. We're going to make it, I want to double check, 16 font and 20 font. Okay, so we're going to make it size 20 font, size 16 font, and the first letter of each main word is going to be 20. <clears throat> Highlight your C for contents. Click that little A up arrow twice. Okay. You're going to center where it says table of contents. Um, and then, okay, something strange. Something strange goes on. Turn on your paragraph markers always. Oh, I see what was going on. Okay. <clears throat> Alrighty. So, I'm going to turn this back into 12 point font. Um... And I'm going to put two spaces in between table of contents and when I start my table of contents. And for now, I'm just going to align it left. And we just called our chapters chapter one and so on. So chapter one, and I'm going to type chapter one through chapter 10 real quick. All right, so I chap type chapter one through 10. And I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so you can see what I'm doing. <laughs> okay. So, let's go back up here. So, um, you are going to have, like, chapter one and so forth on one side of your page. And you're going to have you, the page number on the other side of the page. And you could do that by, like, hitting the space bar a bunch of times. Or you could do that by... Okay, I don't know my actual page numbers. I'm just going to put in a filler for now. You can set your tabs. And you use this little bar to set your tabs. So, for the first tab, you can have these aligned perfectly left if you want. <clears throat> or you can set a tab like maybe half an inch in. And you just click on the half an inch. And you may... Okay, so you want to... <laughs> highlight your column here that's not really a column and then you click your um indent mark and then it's going to do it for each line and so you hit your tab button and it will all right i typed chapters one through ten and i set up um two lines already so you can see what it looks like um i've got my paragraph marks on and it should the little arrows show a tab i set my tabs and so whenever I put my cursor before the line chapter three, I press tab, it moves it over. And then when I put my cursor after chapter three and press tab, it moves it over to the same spot. And of course, my page, this is your page numbers over here, but my page numbers are not one, two, three. I just didn't look them up real quick. 
and you're going to do that on each line so that it lines up um, nice and neat. And I turned off my paragraph marks so you can see how it looks much better than um, it does with the paragraph marks. But you'll do that and you can set your tabs wherever you want. I just put them somewhere to show you and how you set a tab is you just go up here and you click the place where you want the tab to be. Um, I don't want my tab there, so I'm going to undo that. But you just click on your little bar up here where you want your tab to be. And that is how you do your table of contents. Some people use different methods, so if you use a different method, please share that in the comments below. But this is the method I, do, I use, and it works well for me. And one more note about table of contents. Um, I This is a different book I have open now. I have my numbers lined up on the right side and they're not right aligned I just if I turn my paragraph marks on you can see I just put spaces to um, account for I had like 110 down here and so I knew I needed extra spaces up here with one to get them all aligned um, and that's how you do that and when you turn off the paragraph marks nobody knows any different that there's all those spaces there Remember, this is part of a series. Please check the playlist to see if you need any other help with any other aspect of formatting. And there's that longer video that you can look at that will be in the description below. Always ask questions if you want to ask questions. This is a difficult process to do your own interior formatting. So please ask questions. Let's help each other. Um, please comment this comment. Please like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Please share this video and this playlist with others so they can find it too and have help too. And thank you very much for watching. Bye! If you want to know more about Anna Thalian or H.A. Pruitt, please follow me on Instagram at H.A. Pruitt. You can find me on Amazon as an Amazon author, H.A. Pruitt. Please watch my YouTube channel and all my cool videos on my channel, H.A. Pruitt Anna Thalian. You can find me on the Facebook page, H.A. Pruitt Anna Thalian. You can follow me on Goodreads by the name H.A. Pruitt and the book Anna Thalian. Or you can go to my website where so much cool stuff about Anna Thalian is. The website is H.A. Pruitt.com.